So when you buy a newly constructed home, you probably think you'll be avoiding major structural issues. But many new construction buyers have some horror stories of fighting for years over things that weren't done right. So now state lawmakers are stepping in, proposing some changes to protect homeowners. Consumer investigator Steve Steger explains what they're looking at because it is a mess. It's a big deal. This is one of the most popular tips into our tip line. Newly constructed homes with massive problems and builders, developers and others making it tough to get those things fixed. And that's why two Democrats in the Colorado House are proposing a change to state law to give homeowners more protection. Uh, the bill support, uh, sponsored by representatives Jennifer Parenti and Jennifer Bacon would extend the time frame homeowners have to file a lawsuit from six years to 10 years. A lot of homeowners who've sued said that by the time the claims are paid, repairs already cost more because of inflation. So this bill would require interest be paid on any judgment in favor of the homeowner to match inflation and the rising cost of materials. And it would also make it a violation of state law for builders and developers to include a waiver of claims as part of a homeowners association covenant. In other words, it won't allow an HOA to override builders' liabilities for problems. It shouldn't be like this. It is unreasonable to expect homeowners to have tens of thousands of dollars on hand immediately after purchasing a brand new home to fight extended legal battles just to be able to live in a safe and quality home. Speaking of extended battles, you can imagine there's going to be a fight here because builders and developers have long argued that liability for these construction defects is driving up the prices of homes and limiting the stock of new homes. If passed in the state legislature, this bill would be effective this summer. Mm. For anyone that's been a new homeowner, and you t it's a lot to go through, and then you go through that checklist and then inspections, you never, you know, it's a lot. Yeah, and in this case, the law would actually change to say that as soon as you find the structural defect itself, it then starts the clock for okay. how much time you have to file a lawsuit. So before, it was any potential problem like flooding that you spotted, that would start the clock. Now it's, oh, this was built incorrectly. I figured out what it is. That's what starts the clock. It's only the single biggest purchase yeah, pretty much anyone will ever make. And so it's so important think to get about it right. That. You've just spent so much money on a home, you think everything will work just fine, and then you find a huge problem that costs tens of thousands of dollars. Let's see mm. if this helps. Yep. All right, thank you, Steve. Mm -hmm. And for more consumer headlines and ways to save, just go to 9news.com slash Steve on your side.